हेलो दोस्तों मैं आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी अपने घर पर होंगे स्वस्थ होंगे सो so, आज हम इस वीडियो में बात करेंगे टी के एक प्रोसेस के बारे में जिसका नाम है डॉक्यूमेंटेशन प्रोसेस क्योंकि मुझे लास्ट वीडियो पे काफ़ी कमेंट्स आए थे कि कैन यू मेक सम वीडियो ऑन टू द डॉक्यूमेंटेशन सो दैट वी विल नॉट गेट एनी ऑफ द सरप्राइज एट द लास्ट मोमेंट सो आई एम हैप्पी टू गिव दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन बिकॉज आई कलेक्टेड दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन सो मैनी कलीग्स हु आर वर्किंग इन द TCS सी एस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो दैट इन्फॉर्मेशन डेफिनेटली गोइंग टू हेल्प यू आई सा सो मैनी पीपल आर ज्वाइनिंग द टी सी एस बट आफ्टर सर्टन ड्यूरेशन लाइक मे बी द वन मंथ और टू मंथ्स कंपनी फायर दैट पीपल वी नो दैट लाइक इफ एनी ऑफ द डॉक्यूमेंट इज पेंडिंग इन फ्रंट ऑफ द कंपनी सो दैट कंपनी कैन टेक द अदर डिसीजन ऑल्सो सो इन दैट केस लाइक कंपनी कैन टर्मिनेट द कैंडिडेट सो ट्राई टू अवॉइड दिस टाइप ऑफ सिचुएशन एंड get the full information from this video so let's start the documentation part first important document is the your 10th mark sheet because the 10th mark sheet is basically give the proof like your age like it is the criteria to identifying the what is the candidate age so you have to carry that one and the second one is a plus 2 certificate plus 2 certificate is also required and sometime i saw like some people are uh, doing the diploma in place of the in place of the plus 2 so you need to submit that uh, diploma with the all the semester mark sheet you need to upload the other one is the graduation because i saw there are so many cases will come here like so the next document is the graduation like uh, in the graduation there are so many combination will come like if someone are came from the technical background so they need to submit their btech cert btech certificate with all the semester and he is or she is recently passed out so they will definitely get the provisional certificate from the college so you need to submit that one on the behalf of your original because original sometime taking the little bit longer time one year or two year and for the other guy like uh, simple uh, graduation bcom ba and all so they can submit their document similarly the same way the next certificate is your experience letter so the experience letter again like whatever the company you work in which you work so you need to submit all your uh, experience letter and whatever the your immediate last organization you need to submit the two things the your relieving letter if you don't have the relieving letter then you can uh, submit your hr emails and the other one is your uh, salary slip last 3 months salary slip if you are not getting the salary slip then you can show that uh, your bank statement there in place of your salary slip because sometime i saw so many people are not getting the salary slip proper salary slip the next part is uh, our uh, aadhar card so some sometime we need to like if someone have the domicile so they can submit the domicile otherwise they can submit the aadhar card the next one is a pen card you need to submit your pen card because if may or may not be you come under the tax as become as a tax payer so you need to submit that pen card the third one is the the next one, most important document here is the passport because the passport providing you the universal identification so the passport is very mandatory document in all of the organization i am not talking about the tcs only but the other organization also so you need to carry that one and try to avoid the situation like your passport is going to expire in the next one quarter or the two quarter try to avoid that that type of situation because sometime the renewal process is taking the little bit longer time so try to avoid this type of situation also so coming on to the fresher side like i i know the fresher having not having any of the good experience or not having any of the experience so they having the some experience like as a training experience they gain during their uh, degree so they can do this thing like they can submit this uh, training document on to the upload uh, on to the portal and uh, get some of the little bit benefit extra benefit because you know that like if the person have the experience little bit experience so they have the good value as compared to the fresher candidates so the if you know that company uh, like tcs is providing uh, manage internally two year gaps from after the education and your first job so if sometime uh, like it is little bit longer uh, longer than uh, two year or maybe the within the two year so they have the predefined format as a gap certificate so what you can do is you can download that gap certificate or you can request to the hr or download that one and uh, try to uh, fill this information there and uh, put it uh, back there like you need to submit uh, uh, 
you need to write everything onto the stamp paper so that stamp paper can be the 11 rupees 50 rupees or the 100 rupees you can go to the any of the court and from there you can uh, write all the details why there is a gap and after that you have to go to the authorized person like maybe the notary person or the person who have the the authority to attest that document so you need to attest that one and after that take the screenshot and upload that document onto the portal so these all are the mandatory documents so try to collect all the document before going to the induction or before going to upload any of the document if any of the document is not you don't have then try to make that provisional document if still you don't uh, you are struggling with the provisional document also so it will create the big problem for you because at the end company need the some of the proof like you did that type of course or you did that type of uh, training in this particular span because they are going to cross check this particular span only like you are be there at that time or not so that is the overall things so that's the all about the documentation i hope you like this information and uh, if you got or if you need further information related to the any other topic you can let me know through the chat or through the phone number i i believe most of the people know my phone number so you can let me know thank you so much thank you for listening this one we will meet again into the next video thank you so much bye